the group that posted a viral sexually explicit video of a nude representative Madison Cawthorn in bed with another man is now focusing on rap. Lauren Boebert of Colorado for its next takedown, Insider has learned that I think we're going to go after Lauren Boebert in Colorado in a similar way, David B. Wheeler, a co-founder of the American Muckrakers Pack, told Insider Wednesday. I think we're going to engage in that race pretty quickly. The group on Thursday launched FireBobert.com, seeking tips on information, pictures, videos, or documents on Bobert or her associates. A tweet by at FireBobert reads, Hi at Rep Bobert, ask at Rep Cawthorn about us. We look forward to getting to know you. Their logo, a dumpster fire emblazoned with Fire Bobert, while Wheeler is a Democrat, his co-founder is unaffiliated, and the group counts some Republicans among its advisors. Wheeler told Insider on Wednesday had already received interesting information about the Republican firebrand, whose primary against GOP state sin. Don Corm is on June 28. The information is certainly not as salacious as some of the Cawthorn stuff, he said. It deals, instead, with financial matters, he added, declining to disclose more details. A spokesperson for Bober did not immediately respond to a request for comment. Last year, the Associated Press reported that the first year lawmaker failed to disclose her husband's income during her campaign, in violation of ethics and campaign finance laws. She said her husband made nearly $1 million over 2019 and 2020 as a consultant for an energy firm. Former President Donald Trump endorsed Bobert in December as a fearless leader, a defender of the America First agenda, and a fighter against the loserinos and radical Democrats, shortly after she was rebuked for making Islamophobic comments about Democratic rep. Ilhan Omar of Minnesota. Wheeler's Pack also known as FireMadison.com, played a key role in exposing damaging information about Cawthorn, who lost his Republican primary in North Carolina to state sin. Chuck Edwards on Tuesday. The group brought to light Cawthorn's attempt to take a gun through the Asheville Regional Airport last year. It also filed a complaint accusing Cawthorn of violating U.S. House ethics rules, saying he provided free housing and gifts to a staff member. Cawthorn responded to the nude video released by the pack by saying, I was being crass with a friend, trying to be funny. We were acting foolish, and joking. That's it, in Colorado, where Bobert is running for re-election, unaffiliated voters can participate in either the Republican or Democratic primary. Wheeler said he planned to focus on targeted messages through texting and social media to unaffiliated women. We helped fire Madison Cawthorn. Now it's Lauren Bobert's turn, FireBobert.com says. The GQP's Lauren Bobert, who once thought she was representative of Utah instead of Colorado, dished out some doublespeak while feeding Trump's big lie to a crowd. In just 45 seconds she managed to tell a crowd the election was stolen and vote shame Christians for not showing up at the ballot box and thus legitimately giving Congress to the Democrats and the presidency to Biden. So many people are realizing elections have consequences, even if they're stolen, the stable genius said before contradicting her own logic. We have to do our part, especially if you believe in God, if you are a Christian, don't sit back this time. Dot the group that targeted Rep. Madison Cawthorn, RNC, posting a nude video of him online says they are next going to target another outspoken Republican member of Congress, Rep. Lauren Boebert, our American muckrakers pack relentlessly went after Cawthorn ahead of North Carolina GOP primary election that Cawthorn ultimately lost. I think we're gonna go after Lauren Boebert in Colorado in a similar way, the group's co-founder, David B. Wheeler, told Insider. I think we're gonna engage in that race pretty quickly. Wheeler told the outlet that he has interesting information about Bobert, noting that what he supposedly has on her is certainly not as salacious as some of the Cawthorn stuff. Wheeler said the information has to do with finances, 